hi everyone i hope you guys are fine and healthy so i was working on one of my projects today and i came across a situation where i had to make a database and uh, obviously i didn't want to create it from the scratch and also sometimes we don't like even know how the structure of the database is going to be uh, i mean with the regards of our project requirement so in either of the case a database dump file might save our day so i tried to find and download a sql dump file on the google so i thought to share it with you guys okay so here we go okay let's open in Kongi too okay so you can just open any browser uh, we're gonna do a google search so we're gonna write in title okay i have already in my search suggestions you can just click enter and then we will get these results uh, having index of in the title and these are the links to the uh, files having dot sql uh, as their extension or uh, in the name of the files so you can just um, you know you can just click on any of the link and okay um, you will find um, the dot sql file that may help you okay now to narrow down the search keyword um, we have the end title here which will work as a kind of parameter type for the google search engine and then uh, we have two strings in the double quotes and then we have the index of uh, that will make sure that we do not populate web pages in our search and it will limit the um, search result to only populate the path of the files okay now next we have um, a dot sql with an asterisk so um, this means that we are only interested in the files which have dot sql in the extension or to the end of the file name and that will make sure that we only um, populate dot um, sql files in our search results okay but you know this may not be always be helpful you may not get the same database as what you wanted but i'm sure you can just get a database from the results which you think is close enough to your requirements and then get an idea of how to structure your database according to your requirements so, but hold on uh, there's more you can just narrow down the results by modifying the query a bit like uh, for an instance let's say we have the requirement to create a database for the e-commerce purpose so we can just write e-commerce in the query like this e-commerce.sql you can just search it and as you can see it will populate all the links to the files having e-commerce.sql as your names we can just open one and let's see what we get here let's open this one okay. so we have a bunch of .sql file let's open this one okay so we got a dump file for an SQL having multiple tables admin menu okay. these are the um, data promo codes so anyways it may help you in creating or planning your own databases for your own projects or you can just kickstart one of your projects by these and in many other ways you can modify the search query change the extension from dot sql to anything you like 
so one more thing to add is I'm just creating this video for an um, educational purpose uh, I do not mean anything else so please don't misuse it as um, sometimes dumb files may contain sensitive information about others okay. so thanks for watching my video I really appreciate it thank you